relationship of the volume between rectangular prism and pyramid, a cylinder and a cone, a cylinder and a sphere. Volume is the amount of space in three-dimensional figures or objects like cube, pyramid, sphere, rectangular prism, cone, and cylinder. Volume is also called capacity, which is the amount of liquid a container can hold, and it is measured in terms of cubic units represented by a number three. Three-dimensional figures or objects with flat polygonal faces, straight edges, and sharp corners or vertices like the rectangular prism, cube, and pyramid are known as polyhedra. On the other hand, there are solids which are opposite of this. Thus, they are considered as not polyhedra. Examples are cone, sphere, and cylinder. When talking about the relationship between the volumes of both polyhedra, not polyhedra, and combination of polyhedra and not polyhedra, it is much better to see first each of their volumes. Starting with rectangular prism, the formula for the volume is length times width times height. For rectangular pyramid, the volume is one-third times length times width, times height. Looking at the part of the volume of rectangular pyramid, which is length times width times height, which is exactly the volume of rectangular prism, therefore, the relationship between the volume of rectangular pyramid with rectangular prism is that the volume of the pyramid is one-third the volume of rectangular prism. This could mean that the volume of three rectangular pyramid is the capacity of the volume of rectangular prism. As for the cylinder, the volume is pi times radius squared times height or two times pi times radius cube. And for the cone, the volume is one third times pi times radius squared times height. Take note that part of the volume of cone, which is pi times radius squared times height, is exactly the formula for the volume of cylinder. Therefore, the relationship between the volume of cone with the volume of cylinder is that the volume of the cone is one-third the volume of the cylinder. This could mean that volume of three cones is the capacity of the volume of cylinder. For the volume of cylinder, it is volume equals pi times radius squared times height or two times pi times radius cube. And for the sphere, it is volume equals four thirds times pi times radius cube. Take note that part of the volume of sphere, which is pi times radius cube, is also a part of the volume of cylinder. But as you can see, sphere is four thirds only compared to two of the cylinder. Therefore, the relationship of the volume of sphere with the volume of cylinder is that the volume of sphere is four thirds compared to two for the cylinder or simply the sphere's volume is four-thirds of the cylinder's volume, which is six-thirds. Part of the volume of cone with that of sphere and cylinder is the pi times radius cube. The amazing part among the relationship of the volume of cone, sphere, and cylinder is that the cone is two-thirds of it, combined with spear, which is four-thirds, equals six-thirds, or two, which is exactly the volume of cylinder.